because uh Mate, oat milk and coffee is actually insane. But yeah, I bought him a, I bought him one that he wasn't going to use. He was like, "No, I don't, I don't need it. This kettle's got few, it's got a long time left yet." I was like, "All right, mate, fine." How how does the clock mirror go? I mean, I guess we're just mulligan a mage assassin. Maybe we mulligan another one. Who's he? The cat's dad. Have some respect, mate. My name's Specky. You can please use it correctly, please. Mate, I'm, I'm trying to actually finish top 64 this season. That's the other, I think, nice thing about me having, like... Basically, I recorded an update video, guys, for those who aren't aware. I'm going to be streaming Rune Terror and making Rune Terror videos. Um, alongside the Gwent stuff. But I'm literally not going to be, like... It's the same amount of content still, pretty much. Is the idea. I'm not doing it instead of anything Gwent related. But also because of that, it means I feel I'm gonna feel more free about just playing like the good decks and just uploading it. I always feel bad, but now I'm like, eh, whatever. I wanna just have play I wanna play good decks anyway. Double blight maker's pretty unorthodox. Like I wanna play flipping good decks, man, you know? So Coria can go. Probably anyway. Spotter seems pretty good in this matchup though. Adept, not so much. What's the strat of the deck? Yeah, it's just a clock deck. It really is as simple as that, mate. I read Reance. All in clog beats this. What's the difference between this and all in clog? How is this not all in clog? As in, you mean no reants? They're kind of uh, wrecking us a bit, guys. It's not going so well, is it? A superb specimen, truly. Am I being forced to slam the leader? Seems pretty disastrous to do, but mate, honestly. Honestly, mate, it's just not looking so hot. Just about got there. Yeah, pretty much. I just tweaked it a bit because it's changed in provisions. Royal Decree. This guy's deck is weird, champ. Double blight maker. Royal Decree is super inefficient. We should be. We should be winning. Got you back into this game. Good lad. Welcome back, Cold Tight. Yeah, Derby. It's pretty much what changed. Um. He was playing double lock, which I'm not even playing any locks right now, but that's because there's not going to be much uh, in the way of Milva, which that was like definitely a key card. Like the locks are very key for that matchup. It was kind of, kind of an argument to just pass. Now we just wait. Are they really playing on her? Is Reans better than Renew and Clog? Why would you? What, what are you Reen? Yeah, yeah. So Renew Letho just isn't that good anymore because of the Colgrim Adrenaline one. And you just can't go all in on Colgrim anymore. The card's just not that good. So the question here is if we brick another Blightmaker or a Viper Witcher. I think that makes a bunch more sense. Doesn't we are past here? We know one thing. Sun They're not even playing Sunset, are they? I just realized. Yeah, my opponent's deck is tray bad. So, um, I saw Ronian say all in clog beats this.
Oh, because it's Nova, you mean? Because there's no uh, Sunset Wanderers. Hey, this is a great pass for us. A lot of points. I say it's a great pass. Certainly don't want to thin the Sunset Wanderers with this. Ooh. Was that ever going to be okay there? If I kept the Reants, it was going to play for four points less. Would that have made a difference, chat? I don't want scores well. Colgrim's just bad, to be fair. Not a massive fan of the Adept, but we have thinned a fair bit more than them. I think Rian's deserved the buff, honestly. Like, he was never seen playing Hyperth Index, for example, right? Can we update the deck? Is it this one? I don't know. I've got it copied. I'm not sure if it's the correct one or not. Not loving my uh, my chances here, to be honest. How much hatchet master? It sees me every time. Just as I just got bloody clogged. Your life is worth a great deal, my lord. Is Rico ever doing much more? Than the Adept? Probably not. Don't really think I like this play I just made, to be honest. This is a pretty bad play, man. It's probably how I just lose the game, because now my sunset thins, right? I kind of just threw. I really didn't need to do that. Apparently they don't care. Alright, well, that was nice of them. Ooh, not bad. Okay. Could have high rolled. There's nothing particularly I wanted from their graveyard. I mean, I could have put, like, I guess, Knickers. But it also meant I was going to have to play the Mentor. Actually, slamming the leader. It's kind of insane. No, because it's a token. I don't really know who wins this. I should have not used the Reance though, that's for sure. That's one way I could have tried to win. I mean, considering I have an extra card, you'd imagine I'm favoured. What? Why, why would you do that? They just gave me a Sunset Wanderers, guys. Cheers, mate. <gasps> I mean, the bad news is that the card is going to... Uh, they can clog me with something, right? Well, I just don't play any bad cards. They can't clog me with something bad. Mate, is Spotter good here? Could be. Okay, we drew the nuts. Do we go for the Spotter of Dreams chat? We could just play this first. I haven't thinned more though, so I have like no... <gasps> Viper Witcher Alchemist for three points onto their Colgrim. Uh, Guys, we can give them our Colgrim. That's hilarious. <laughs> Gives us a mental value on nine as well. 
What a play, mate. What a play. Mate, we didn't even get to see it, guys. I was going to put Knickers on top of their deck, steal it with Spotter. We didn't even get to see it, man. <laughs> Let's go. Thanks for the bits, but more importantly, thanks for the message. I think the people needed to hear it. So someone playing Kelly Alza. Uh, Kelly Alza is actually another thing that I, I think it was before. I think it was actually before Masters. I thought it was like a super legit thing for Freddy's Masters. But then obviously Alza is just best in ST ever since they printed orbs. Because you get value on deploy guaranteed. So I could have played Spotter opener. There is also a problem in this deck that you can just end up, like, your spotter can end up, like, only offering you bad cards or good cards to give you to your opponent. That's where you can also just combine it with the Gortha route. This, uh, collar's not looking too hot. This guy's just so risky. Like, imagine I'm playing Heatwave. I mean, I guess I have no choice. I didn't really pay attention. So really we're looking for like DMT, which we didn't have in hand. I didn't, I didn't actually know where it was. Snowdrop was bottom card though, right? Kind of makes my decision for me. In fairness. I guess I end up slamming my leader anyway. Which honestly... So I've also built a Kelly deck, guys. I do think Kelly's pretty good. Specimen. I've actually got an idea, chat. What if, guys, we clog? Clog the defender? We maybe shouldn't have put defender on top, but rather like a code weapons then. If I realized this was the line earlier. We get away with it, because there's a bad card there. Bruh. That's actually sick. Oof. The spotter is popping off, mate. Got double defender now, boy. Quick, and strike hard. 69. My favorite number. Do you know why it is, guys? This is a really bad time to play it, unless they get ahead already. Six plus four is ten. That was a really bad play from them. I say that, we still lost on even. Is this the game that Witcher is based on? Yes. Yeah, so the Witcher Netflix series is based on uh, Gwent, the Witcher card game. Um... Freya Allen is actually a big fan of mine. Yeah, she watches all my stuff. Mm -hmm. 
Guys, I think we're going to lose the video game. Spoiler alert. This is like the worst matchup imaginable. I don't think we should uh, get rid of the Colgrims. I guess that was my draw. I guess the Defender could be my draw plus card. Or this. So, if they pass... pretty OP that in it I'm not gonna lie guys that is quite OP I'm gonna throw it out there it's not that balanced this is quite OP Mate, what happened to your face? I shaved. Do you like it? Do you like it? So, this is, uh... Hmm, this is, uh... This is, uh... Hmm. This is, uh, fine. All right. I mean, if I had a defender, maybe. Guys, what if they secretly don't play spores? Or, or don't, don't draw their spores. Either or. Hey, Lion, love to see you, mate. Yeah, it's alright. I think uh, old spear tip's a bit, mm, a bit monker. Mate, I've actually started speaking in Twitch emotes. It's awful. Old spear tip is a little bit monker, mate. Yeah. Oh, believe in the alchemist. Oh, that was actually quite cool. <laughs> spores, mate. Spores is not a real card. I clogged them. There's no way they found the spores, man. Trust me. Oh shit. I wasted a few points there. Keck W. <laughs> nice. They don't play sports, guys. Trust me. What an easy victory. They cannot keep up with this absolute tempo, mate. Guys, they don't play sports. Trust me. They don't play sports, guys. <gasps> what an epic win. They don't play... I knew the sports was coming, but for the content, man, I had to pretend I didn't think it was. Thank you, Vanix, so much for the five gifted, man. JCM, Lil4 to me, Punching Bag, Nifulan, and Do Gunder Arrest. Vanix, thank you so much for the five gifted. What a geezer, I really appreciate it, man. GG Crazy. How's Kelly working out for you, man? Oh, and I gifted some to Crows here as well, mate. Thank you, man. Yeah, how's Kelly working out? I've also got a Kelly deck built. It looked pretty much the same, actually. I think it might be exactly the same. You just have to cut the unicorn, right? Which is pretty sad, to be fair, but... 
Yeah. So you had double Witch Apprentice. I'm not sure if I had two. Maybe I just had one. But two seems like a lot more easy. Uh, a lot more. Uh, two seems a lot more reasonable, right? With uh, an 18 point spear tip. Kelly is pretty broken. Yeah, I did say like I was chatting to um some TLG people yesterday about like monsters this season. And uh, I got copiumed when I said that Kelly would be good. Sure. Just shows what some of them know. <laughs> it wasn't even meant to be, man. I was just thinking, that's fine. I thought it was good. <laughs> I would have I would have done it in the exact same order. I mean, you had the Peller anyway, right? So. It would have been a, it would have been a struggle. I suppose I could have gone for the Adept, but it's likely to die anyway. Thanks again, Fanix, for the six gifted. That's really kind. Very sad. Kelly is a thing again. Specky, where's the Renegade deck? Yeah, I would like to play some Renegade. I started playing Colgan today and got wrecked by Kelly twice. Yeah, it seems like a pretty awful matchup, right? I think just can't deal with Defender. You've just got all the engines to compete for round one. Yeah, well, I played earlier. I played some hand buff. I actually had a pretty good, uh, pretty good showing with hand buff. Although I don't think my opponents necessarily played that well. I played a little bit of Mayamon's Vamps. I was actually going to play Kelly, but I thought Vamps... It, it was for a video that's going to go up live on my channel. I thought that Regis is more likely to get views. And I'll play Kelly another time. Oh yeah, you can clog the gin, I forget. Thanks. I don't actually play clog much, as evidenced by this, this play I made. Uh, I mean, Mage Assassin Alpha near the bottom seems like a Rico at the bottom of the deck. Also, I don't want to top deck Colgrim, right? Why am I giving them Blight Makers? Okay, mistakes were made, guys, all right? There's a... a, a Pyabol, what do you even know about Gwen? Are you some sort of expert or something? Fuck's sake, man. Some people. Like, you're the one watching, mate. Yeah? I'm the one playing, so shut your mouth. Do we ditch Adept or nah? Probably not. Not sure I like this place so much, but. They passed? Really? Guys, I was just jamming cards. I thought I didn't have to think about my plays, you know? So I've got 10 points. Look at this Chad card that does them, that does it, mate. Can I have a look. Does this also do it, actually? Gortha into Viper Witcher. Viper Witcher plays for 5. 7. 15, guys. So he cogged the Blightmaker, right? Oh my god, the bleeding tick. Oh my god, I thought I did the maths wrong. <sighs> Holy moly. Oh god. I could have clogged Diplo, but I have a uh, alchemist. That was scary, mate. We made some pretty serious misplays earlier as well, so wouldn't have been super surprising. Are we ever in the market for slam jamming the Colgrim? This is a bit of a juicer of a hand, is it not? Guys, this is a bit of a juicer. I think I should have given him the assassin to pair with the blight maker I gave him earlier. Haha. Very funny, mate. 
Very funny guy. You are a fun guy, Pajatko. <sighs> Guys, I might actually uh, be going to Poland to visit in a few months and go meet my boy Pajatko. That's going to be pretty sick, isn't it? That's going to be pretty epic. Yeah, reinch. <laughs> Yo, Stella, I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry, man. I've sold my soul to the devil for the views, mate. I'm a change, man. If moved to the top of your deck during your turn. Okay, guys. Are you ready for the epic play? Chat. Hey, chat. Are you ready for the epic play? I'll give him a major set. Oh, no, wait. Guys, he's got Blightmaker. Pretty epic. Admittedly, I shouldn't have the Colgrim still in hand, right? I, I must confess. This was maybe a slight oversight. Nice adrenaline, bro. No, Letho? Letho's for scrubs, mate. Do I look like a scrub to you? Get absolutely seven for five, mate. And clogged. Kinda. Not really. Uh, yeah, I, I did used to play left though, but he's bad ever since Colgrim. Uh, adrenaline. Colgrim's adrenaline got nerfed, right? Doesn't die to assassination, he bruvs. Mongolgrim! <laughs> no gold grip for you, boy! Get wrecked. Guys. What do we do with the hand? Do we do anything?
I mean, I'm not. I don't think I'm going to slam lead with this hand. I'd rather just have a playable card. Therefore, the hand just doesn't really look like it's worth slamming leader with. So I decided instead of actually. Having an unplayable hand, I might as well just commit. Has the deck changed at all? Yes, a little. But also, like, I'm not playing locks, which you could definitely play locks. I just don't really want to play locks on day one like, when I can play the alchemist, mate. Instead. So I've actually got a couple of options. I could open with Gortha into Adept, it's my best engine value play. In terms of thinning, I can just go Cynthia or Maxi. Don't really want to play the Cynthia in case I go for a random spotter. Your magic can't harm me. No magic can't. Oh, mate, what a deck. That's a deck. Being given the courier. Courier, courier. 10 for 5, guys. That is broke. Oh my god, guys. Maxi's a 13 for 5. Isn't that OP, chat? Actually. Wait, what the hell? Guys, did you know that? That Maxi is a 13 for 5. That's insane value right there. Who needs locks, guys, right? Yeah. Oh, oh. Love can make one do crazy things. The loss of love even more so. I do love a bit of Istrid. Do we, should we El Alchemisto them, guys? We haven't clogged, right? We've got, we've got to do it for old time's sake, guys. <laughs> guys, we can Shani the spotter. We can Shani the spotter, guys. <laughs> Unbelievable techers, mate. Incredible. So if you actually if you actually think about what happened, right? We just high rolled their best card. Which can happen. Yeah. We high rolled their best card and we gave them a card they mulligan, which is the same as clogging them, right? We gave them a five point card, which they're gonna mulligan. Which is the same as a three point card they're gonna mulligan. So not only did we clog their deck with a bad card that they have forced to mulligan, which is the the biggest value of the clog, but we also steal their best card. Which means not only do they not get this card, which is on top of their deck, by the way. This is a card they were going to draw. We get to use it ourselves. Best cold card in the game. Fact. It's just awkward to use sometimes. Mate, I even, I even convinced Freddy and Green Knight that I was right. I actually did. They did, like, even Green Knight, the world's biggest Warrit hater, mate. <laughs> I even convinced him that my logic was correct. How do you have an animated copium, man? Yeah, I just joined to copy his dick. I want to go up to 350. Nice. Istrid's kind of smurf. It's probably time for the Istrid snowdrop decks, man. Last time I tried to play uh, Istrid snowdrop, I decided, oh, uh, actually, this is just an NR mill deck. <laughs> That's what happened last time I tried to play Istrid. I was like, oh cool, this is pretty good in NR Mill. Yeah, but that's true. He's point and uh, Adepts, right? Adepts are pretty pretty good cards if you want them to be. Ooh, if I put the Envoy. 
They have a lot of answers to my uh, clogs. Your life was worth a great deal, my lord. Take comfort in that. Hey, King Denevib, we are clogging, mate, yeah. Can confirm. So what I should be doing with this deck is I should have premium, non-premium of every card. So when I maxi, I know which ones I'm supposed to be taking. Now, right? Is there any way to fit Ivar into this? Not really. Check my screenshot. I need how many points? 22. I'm gaining one point, so I need 21. Uh, 21, which we don't have. But do you know what we do have? A Gerhardt or a Patience 9 student, perhaps. With our Elok Bistoshanese. Defender's got to go. This is fine. Next card. I mean, I'm not going to use leader this round, so whatever. Shield's bug is still here, unfortunately. It's a bit rubbish. My man is just playing straight into the coated weapons. Okay, guys, here we go. Big moment. Should we steal the Istrid for the Istrid Snowdrop? Potential. Absolutely. This is a fantastic opportunity. What do you mean, steal? Varu? Varu? Guys? Uh, Varu? Varu, guys? Any Varus in the ch that's more than Wait, Wait they have off. patience for Istrid? That's broken, mate. How did they get that? How the hell did they get that, guys? What the hell? That's kind of OP, mate, honestly. I'm not sure that's very balanced, mate. They've got Patience 5 Istrid. How did he get... I don't know. How did he get Istrid back? It wasn't anything to do with me, mate. I would never give them that back. I'm a, I'm a pro player. All because I wanted Istrid, Istrid Snowdrop. I wanted to do it for you guys, and now you sat here Pepe fucking pointing me, man. <gasps> guys, we clogged them, look! Get clogged, mate. So I have six points plus six. I guess I could get rid of the Mage Assassin. So I have six points plus ten. That's sixteen. Mm, 
A superb specimen, truly. Oh god. Afan? Question mark? Yes, I thought so. Stop giving him Istrids. Don't tell me what to do, mate. I like Istrid. He's a cool guy. Nah, uh, I've actually done uh, two streams today. Guys, Reance is absolutely popping off, bruv. Look at this value right here. Oh, look at this value, guys. How could they even compete with this value, man? Look at this shit, guys. So we... Wait, what? But... Huh? What? Wait... Huh? Is that a is that a bug, guys? Did we just lose to a bug? Let's go! <laughs> Get out played, guys. Take notes. That is how you play Nilfgaard. I hope you're writing this down, man. Hmm. Mm. Joe? Don't call me Joe, mate. Don't call me my, my government name. I don't like it. Winning with throw? How is it a throw? Guys, I've got the wombo combo. I've got the wombo combo. <sighs> Where are the gold cards, chat? This is not what I signed up for, man. This is just a mini warrant, guys. Sometimes it doesn't work. As long as our top three cards aren't golds, we're fine. Uh, no. Okay, it's not ideal, but all right. Okay. Could have been worse. Listen, the spotter can be Trey bad. But it's kind of cute. I bet, like, we wouldn't feel so bad if it was more than a lava, but it was more like a uh, minus four. No, it's only when you move. If it's Afan, it's, that would have been minus points. But Mage Assassin's don't work like, like they used to actually but they don't but that means we thin one less now that is the bad news this guy's pretty shooketh i would say
Specky, I would like a formal report for the justification of my temporary ban from this establishment by tonight or I will submit my official complaint to Bezos himself. Uh, who is Bezos? I'm not familiar. Alright guys, so we've got uh, Reince, I've got Kelly, I've also got Salamander. What else have I got? Oh, I've got Patience Northern Realms. Any syndicate bounty ideas? If by bounty do you mean Salamander? <laughs> because if you do, then yes. I've got lots of ideas. Still the best deck in the game, by the way. I think it's like even more... Even more uncontested at the top as well. Because it's just such an efficient way of playing the extra three tribute. Scapegoat me. Oh, scapegoat unitless ST actually sounds like a lot of fun. Oh, I'll probably just do the classic salamander tonight. And then tomorrow we can actually get to experimenting. I've kind of changed my way of doing things. Previously, I would like experiment on day one. Um, and then start playing the serious stuff later on. Whereas I'm kind of doing it the other way around. I kind of just going to play the serious decks, get them out of the way, upload them. And then start experimenting from then. Salamander looks kind of bad for now. A lot of Kelly. That's fair. That is actually a good point. It's like Kelly was the worst matchup I had with that deck. Not all dragons gold. So maybe we could just do unitless then with Scorch. Ah, oh, actually, I don't know if we can actually play Scorch. Mmm. Mmm. Not sure I should play Scorch with a uh, Syndicate. I would actually like to, though. I guess we get rid of... What do you guys think we get rid of? Code Weapons is good. I guess it's an Adept and a Viper Witcher. Lava? Guys. Guys. Come on. This card's OP. Synergizes my leader as well, isn't it? Is this clog in meta right now? Did we really went from no units to clog? Sometimes maybe shit. Sometimes maybe good. Oh, I said it the wrong way around, didn't I? Unitless Syndicate with a uh, scapegoat sounds like a lot of fun, actually. Must admit. Defeat them with hunger. Crush them with thirst. Pass, dude. Oh shoot, I actually knew that. Af I actually didn't know the Afan was there. My men know the meaning of sacrifice. Bruh, are you serious? Do you guys guess we lose, do we? Do we just 2 0? Do you guys think I have, um. Or do I even care, rather? Guys, what if we bleed the she who knows? Reance or no balls? Monsters know a 
goat will suffice for now. Unfollow? Absolute coward. You just lost a gifted sub. Well, we'll find out in the mulligans I'm about to take if it was the correct decision or not. Okay, top three units, remember. Ah, top three units, guys. Uh -oh. <laughs> uh oh. Defender. Absolutely punished for giving them a mage assassin. And, uh, not thinning the Afan. Fuck's sake, man. Karma. And also not using the reins to thin, in fairness. Bottom card. This went a little bit pear shaped, I would say. I actually got really unlucky because I missed both major assassins. I guess I just was Afan, right? Spot are bad. This wasn't the spotter's fault, to be fair. Just the timing of the spotter, if anything. Also, I could have just slammed Reance for it. I would have been fine. They might not even play Tool Punish. They probably do, though. Spotter is shite. No. Don't blame the Spotter for my misplays. Please, have some respect. That's pretty sick. So what we actually get to do here is we get to kill Gurney Cora's fruit, guys. That's pretty cool. Uh, Shinmiri. I think. I think. Uh, defender, defender, defender. Oh. Guys, I was playing around this. Look. I was playing around this, guys. Look. The Pope was right. Mate, I actually have... Shin, I actually clipped me watching that and I have it ready to post on YouTube, but I've never posted it. <laughs> When I reacted to you <laughs> saying about the Pope. <laughs> why is Rian's order now? I mean, why not? Why not? I'm aware I was going to kill it. So put she who throws on top. Bang. Value. Guys, what an easy victory, right? This is insane. We just got so much value, mate. We just can't lose, man. We just can't lose, man. Okay, this went badly. I'm not going to lie. The spotter didn't pop off in this one. But you guys have got to think for the future...
This is pretty close, actually. Yeah, it's well the same as Old Alchemist. Thanks, Jen. 